असलम एंड हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू अस्मा के नाइन डोंट फॉर गेट टू लाइक दिस वीडियो एंड सब्सक्राइब टू माई यूट्यूब चैनल सो लेट स्टार्ट सो फ्रेंड्स आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू द प्रोसेस ऑफ इंटीग्रेटिंग योर पाइथन बेस्ड रासा चैट बॉट्स इंटरक्टिव चैट विजिट विद अ सिंपल वेब पेज सो कीप वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड विद रासा प्लेटफॉर्म यू कैन इंटीग्रेट द पाइथन बेस्ड चैट बॉट विद योर वेब पेज इधर यूजिंग सॉकेट डॉट आयो मेथड और विद द हेल्प ऑफ इनेबलिंग चैट बॉट एज ए पी आई आई एम गोइंग टू यूज द सॉकेट डॉट आयो मेथड बिकॉज रासा प्लेटफॉर्म बाय डिफॉर्ट all provides a rich interactive chat widget with this method as for api method you need to either create the web based chat widget by yourself or depend on the third party jquery based chat widget plugins that support the web api's integration so i recommend the socket.io method instead as it's much simpler and save a lot of time If you are new to my channel you can check out my video on installation of Rasa platform on Windows machine and you can also check out my video on training chatbot with Rasa platform links are available in the description I'm using the same directory structure for the Rasa platform from my previous videos so go to the Rasa root directory on your Windows machine and then open the source directory Now open the credentials file in either Notepad or Notepad++ and enable these lines of code. Use the user and bot event names exactly as defined here. These lines of code will enable the communication between the bot and the user via an interactive chat widget. Rasa platform by default provides this web widget. We just need to enable it via socket.io method. So this is a socket.io method. Create index.html file within the source directory. and add these lines of code in it these two lines are important as they will integrate the rasa chat widget within your web page now open the command prompt as administrator and change into rasa source directory using this command Use this command to set your target Python compiler version's necessary directory paths to Windows environment path variable. Next, check if Python version has been changed to your target Python version with the help of this command. Now enter this command to create Python virtual environment if not already created. Then activate the Python virtual environment with this command. Make sure the models folder is empty and then use this command to train the Python Rasa chatbot. Once your model is trained, use this command to activate Rasa platform for the interactive chat widget. Now open the index page that we have just created in the web browser. and notice a small blue chat icon at the bottom right corner of the web page click on this icon and have a conversation with the bot you can notice the interactive buttons and images within this chat widget as well so what do you guys think about rasa chatbot platform do you find it simple are you excited for my upcoming videos about python rasa bot platform on windows machine let me know in the comment section below and subscribe to my channel for more such interesting videos thank you for watching take care and allah hafiz